I usually call it the funk. Or actually, a funk. As in, I'm in a funk when I can't create. Most of the funks I get in result in times when I'm not motivated to draw. Not only to draw, but to really make or do pretty much anything. I'm lethargic. I'm stereotyped, staring out of the window with literally no thoughts in my head, only feelings swimming around in my body, like sediment being carried by a stream, adrift, no destination in mind, just taking a journey is all. During those times, the things I'm feeling are hopelessness, disappointment, helplessness, aggravation, and self-pity, which are typically triggered by a combination of Donald Trump, the state of the nation, my own creative blocks, a dirty house, and the weird inability to muster up the energy to change any of my situation. My most recent funk was not this way at all, though. It was more along the lines of being motivated to create something. I, I wanted to make something. I really wanted to make something, like, really bad, but had absolutely no idea as to what that should be. I mean, I would sit down with the intention and the urge to create something, even to draw something, and, and nothing would come out. I mean, nothing. It really was the most unusual thing. After a few days of this, I finally told myself to just work on the after death. Just sit down and continue working on the comic. The thing is, I usually have the after death planned out a few scenes ahead than what I share online. Sometimes I even have the script written and I know exactly how I want to illustrate each panel and all there really is to do is to literally sit and draw it. When I got into this weird new funk, I told myself, you want to draw so bad but you don't know what to draw? Just draw something you know will come easy. So I sat down and began working on the next few strips of the after death. Like I said, I was motivated, but I think I just couldn't kick my imagination into gear to come up with anything new to draw. The solution it turned out was to sit down and work on something I've come to really know and love, and that's my comic. I can't say I'm completely out of my new funk. After all, the election is still a month away and I know I won't be able to escape the yelling heads, uh, the talking heads for that long. But while I was working on the comic, I actually did get a spark of inspiration and imagination, which became a new Halloween themed heart design that I drew one morning. It was nice to feel that feeling again. The feeling of dreaming something up and bringing it to life on a page where there was nothing there before. All before lunch. Creating something like that is a little bit different than the comic in the way that it's new. I know the characters of the after death, and writing and drawing Spencer and Reggie is more like my creative marathon. Whereas the spooky heart design, if we keep with the marathon motif, is the moment during the marathon where you reach the point along the route where the trees part and beyond are mountains or rolling hills or a serene lake or some other miracle of nature and you just take in and appreciate the beauty around you and it makes the marathon you're on a little easier.
So that's the new funk that I'm in. That I, like I said, I, I don't see myself entirely out of it, but it's nice to have the comic to fall back on. Whenever I just really want to draw something and need to push through and, and not feeling 100%, I can always rely on the after death. And that's kind of nice. Hey guys, before we reach the end of the video, I just wanted to say thanks for watching. I super appreciate it. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe. And if you are already subscribed, then I'll see you next time. Take it easy.